Mm-hmm. Oh. Somebody said they want to see me do the Hindu. I know I can't do the Hindu, not with the Zulus. I do the Hindu with a salad. But matter of fact, I'm gonna show you. This is what the Hindu gonna look like. It ain't gonna look like with the Zulus. It look like. Oh, it don't look bad. I thought it was gonna look bad. I, f I forgot. I forgot the Zulus is not that long. And by the way, for everybody that don't know what the Hindu is, the Hindu is basically this. So if you see somebody do this, that is called the Hindu. You feel me? Because I was eating a salad on here one day, you know, and I was eating it with a, with a fork like this. And something just told me, you know, the ancestors and my spirit guys started talking to me. And they was like, man, something is missing. I mean, they was like, the salad is busting. But the only reason it don't feel like it's busting, busting is because you're not eating it with your hand. You over here all proper using a fork. It's a disconnection between you and the food. Man, you got to tap in. You got to use your hand. You got to become one with it like this. And that right there, that is called the handle. You feel me? So when you see somebody do this, this the handle. When somebody eating with their hand, look at them. That boy over there, he a handle. I know Hindu is a religion, but we're going to slide ourselves next to the religion and call this the Hindu. So when you see somebody eating a salad or you see some Haitians or some Africans eating rice and they hit you with a little twisty and then they pop up with a meal like this, huh? Mm. That is called the Hindu. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so now, man, if you want to be one, if you want to connect with the food, like if you want to, if you want the food to be bussing, bussing. Like your food could be good, it could be high, right, it could be bussing. But if you want to be, if you want it to be bussing, bussing, you gotta create a connection with it. You gotta bond with the food. You gotta touch it. I mean, you gotta feel it. You gotta put your hand in it. I mean, and then you hit it with the, I mean, and you turn it around. You don't just pick it up all proper. You don't do it like this. You don't just. No. That's not a Hindu. A Hindu is basically show me what that Hindu. So, you know, you hit it with the eh, and then you twist it. You got to hit it with a twist. If you don't hit it with a twist, it's not the Hindu. Right. It's only the Hindu when you show me what that Hindu. You in and then you in and then you go up. I mean, it's a three thing motion. It does one and then two and then boom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how you hit it with the handle. Hey, yo, y'all wildin'. Y'all got me over here. Y'all got me over here acting a fool. Just laughing at me. <laughs> watching me hit the watching me hit the zoodle with the handle. <laughs> nah, bruh. Nah. <laughs> I'm about to start making y'all pay so y'all can see me hit the handle. <laughs> I mean, this is this is a skill. It took me a lot to practice this. Y'all know how Steph Curry be in a gym like this all day? I put in work for this. I deserve a contract just like they got NBA contracts because it took me a lot for me to go eh, and then eh, and then eh, and do it with perfection. You see how that came about? That's the handle. You got to work on that. Like, I mean, y'all got to take care of me. Y'all got, got to hit that cash app or something like, you feel me? I'm teaching y'all how to do the, the handle, you know, the end, the end, the bam, yeah. I need a gold medal or something. Damn. Mm -hmm. And by the way, if you at home and you thinking about trying to handle, like, make sure your nails, make sure everything is clean. I mean, don't just go to the bathroom and then go in your bowl and try to hit the Hindu. That ain't going to be no Hindu. That's going to be some Hindu do. I mean, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Make sure your hand is clean, family. <laughs> All right? like, make, sure, make sure it's clean. We don't want no Hindu do. The Hindu, cool. Hindu do? Nah. <laughs> mm. I'm just saying, I'm trying to help you out. I'm trying to help you out. I'm trying to make sure you eat. I'm trying to make sure you eat like Subway. Subway, eat fresh. I mean, mm -hmm. 
Can someone tell me what's inside the bowl? It's some zucchini noodles, fam. Get you a spiralizer. Get you some zucchini. Turn it into some zucchini noodles, but we call it zoodles in the family. You know, chop you up some bell peppers, some cherry tomatoes, some purple onions. Get you some fresh cilantro, fresh basil, fresh scallions, oregano, red crushed red pepper, pink Himalayan sea salt, and some key limes. And then, boom! You can hit it with a handle. I mean, y'all see the motion? Bam, bam, bam. You know, you don't just, nah. Your love by the family. Thank you, thank you, Sue Singer. I love y'all too. Y'all know it's all love, you know. Every here and there, we tap in and we laugh because, you know, the majority, the reason why we do this, you know, is to inspire each other, is to raise each other's vibration. And the easiest way to raise someone's vibration is by telling them you love them. You know, because when people feel love, they start to walk better, they start to look better, they start to, they start to think better, they start to attract better. And as your vibration rises, all it takes is one idea to literally change your whole life around. So we literally have the power, you know, to change each other's lives by using the power of our tongue. And that's exactly what I just did there with the handle. Y'all was just in a, you know, in a comment section, y'all laughing, you know, which is raising your vibration because laughter is great for the soul. And this right here was literally, you know, something that a lot of people needed. There are people that are dealing with things that needed a good laugh, like, you know, depression, anxiety and stress. And, you know, and I and I didn't do it, you know, like I planned to do it. You know, it just come out of me like a lot of times when we go live, it just come out. Kundalini, much love, family. I love you, too, family. So, yeah, man, for everybody that needed a good laugh, whether you was going through anything or whether you needed a good laugh just to have a good laugh because you don't need to be going through something to, you know, to laugh and, and enjoy your life, you know.